Hi guys, today we're going to be talking about the vamps of loafers and how different lengths of vamps might affect how formal the loafer looks and how it affects the appearance of your foot. So first we'll start with a little terminology. Uh, the vamp refers to this, it refers to the tip of the shoe to the top of the tongue. It's this section here. And I'm going to put these loafers on the ground so you can see side by side uh, how they might vary. So all these fit me, they're all a size 8. Um, what I'm wearing today, actually, is a pair of Koji Suzuki bespoke loafers. Now, just as a bit of interesting side trivia, um, Koji, who's a great bespoke shoemaker based in Osaka, um, oh, sorry, no, based in Kobe, he trained with Roberto Ugolini in Florence. And so he really picked up the Italian style of doing a loafer, which is to make it with a very long vamp. Now, let me slip on the two ready to wear loafers so you can have an idea of how that vamp changes the appearance of your foot. So let's start with this. This is the Armory Hudson loafer. It's our entry-level loafer, and we purposely did it with a very, very short band. And this is the Foster & Sons Arlington, which is a very high-end ready-to-wear loafer, comparable to something like an Edward Green. Now, despite the size and actually the length of these shoes being about the same, you can probably notice that the Arlington, the black loafer on the right, has a look much narrower and actually much longer. Like, for instance, if I took my foot away like that, you really noticed how kind of rakish that shape is. And for me, this is really a great loafer to be wearing with a suit. Now, going back to the Hudson, like that, if you look at the Hudson on its own, the Hudson, we purposely designed it as being quite sporty, a little bit on the soft side in terms of shape, and I think it's great for sport coats and cotton chinos, I think it's great for um, denim, and in a pinch you could still use it with a suit too. There you go, the two side by side. So, I hope this was helpful, I mean it's really kind of just prompting everyone to think a little bit about when you buy a loafer, what does the vamp mean and how it might affect its intended use. Thanks for watching.